passion for cheerleading started when I was six years old and it's been growing ever since. When I was a kid, I used to always beg my mom to stay late at cheerleading competitions so that I could watch the Open Level 6 athletes because the skills that they put on the floor were incredible and I knew that I always wanted to be one of those athletes. Fast forward 15 years and I was finishing up university. I was the head captain of my cheerleading team and I had absolutely no idea what I wanted to do with my life, but I was really hoping that somehow cheerleading would stay a part of it. Hello, I'm Dr. Scott Christie. I am the co-founder and president of Cheer District. I've been involved in the healthcare industry and fitness industry for over 20 years. I currently own two practices which incorporate many different healthcare practitioners. My, my background wasn't always as a, as a chiropractor. I was a sports scientist for, I, I think, going on almost 20 years. One of the things that I was looking at doing was developing strength and conditioning for cheerleading. We kind of sat down and, and hammered out a plan as to how we were going to make the strength and conditioning program work for cheerleading. And at that point, we came up with the idea of, of developing Cheer District. Brianne went out and started to look at different ways that we could get this to the cheerleading world. I'm passionate about Cheer District for so many different reasons. I really want to share with athletes why it's so important to train their bodies outside of practice. I know from personal experience that if you don't, the effects are everlasting. I truly believe that if I had had these tools, I would have been able to drastically increase my skill set because I would have been way less prone to injury. So I've been involved in many different sports and one of the things you'll notice with these sports, they actually do conditioning outside of their practice. But in cheerleading, there's not as much time to do the conditioning. They're not going to do a lot of the conditioning at practice because when you're at practice, you should be doing practice. So in that aspect, I try to put together something for them that they can actually do at home. There are better ways to train, but having the appropriate programs is going to help reduce the injuries. And if you have less injury, you can practice more. And when you practice more, you have better performance. We don't, in cheerleading, have to have the physiological background that some other sports or trainers have to have. By giving this tool to them, they now have that in their back pocket. They don't necessarily have to have that expertise, but they're able to share that with their athletes so that they can get longevity out of their athletes, less injured athletes, hopefully, if their athletes are using this properly. And then hopefully they can create better teams. In my last year All-Star Cheerleading, I had to sit out a bunch because I had such bad back pain I was going to chiropractic and physio like three four times a week and now I'm in my 20s and I'm still uncomfortable all the time I can't sit at my desk I can't ride airplanes I can't sit in the car for a really long time without feeling that pain and I feel like that wouldn't have happened if I had had these tools in order to take care of myself when I was an athlete so that now post-athlete, I wouldn't be in this position. I want athletes to know the benefit of working out for their sport and making it a part of their weekly routine. The workouts curated by Dr. Scott are unmatched, and if you take ownership of yourself, understand the intensity of the sport, you really can excel in all areas. The community platform we have created includes cheerleading-specific training, coaching tools, never-before-seen analytics, and social networking. By bringing this all together, it gives us all the tools to grow our industry and to grow as individuals in the sport. Head to the App Store and download the Cheer District app to discover it for yourself.